Hi there, this is Learning Buddy and today we will start the 30 common usage problems in the English language. Let's begin with the word accept and accept. Alam natin na marami ang nagliliito pa rin sa dalawang salitang ito. No? But they are different in a way that the other one is a verb while the other one is a preposition. Let's begin with the word accept. Accept is a word which means to receive. It is a verb. It is used as the verb of the sentence. It is not used as a preposition. Let's have the example sentence. I accepted the offer. In this sentence, the underlined word is accepted. That is a verb, which means received or to receive. But in this case, since the verb is in the past or in the simple past tense of the verb, it is a verb. Okay? It is used to express that someone or the subject I received something, received an offer. Okay? So that's how we use the word accept. Pasalagin tandaan, when we say accept means to receive. When we say accept, it is a preposition which means other than. Okay? Maliban sa. Okay? So halimbawa na lang sinabi na lahat ay gusto ko accept sa ice cream. I hate ice cream. Just like that. So, when we say except, meron exemption. Okay? So, maliban sa isang bagay. Let's begin with this example. I took the offer except the overtime work. In this sentence, the verb is not except. Okay? Kasi except siya means exemption. Alright? So, ang ating verb dito ay ang took. Okay? Now, ano naman ang function ng except? Okay? It's a preposition. Ibig sabihin, pang-ukol siya. Ginagamit siya bilang isang pang-ukol at hindi pandiwa. Tandaan na, ang accept na may letter A ay pandiwa. Ang accept na E ay preposition. Which means other than. Okay? Tinanggap lahat. Other than. Okay? Or maliban sa. Right? So that's how accept and accept differs from one another. Accept is a verb. Accept is a preposition. Maliban sa magkaiba silang spelling, magkaiba rin sila ng function sa isang pangungusap. Don't forget that. Thank you.